talking about breakfast. Linda's family prepares for breakfast and has it together on the weekend. Watch the video below and learn about having conversations between family members at breakfast. Mom! What happened, Linda? Why do you call out in the early morning like that? Dad, where is Mom? I'm ravenous. She is doing yoga in the yard. Thanks, Dad. Mom, I'm extremely hungry. Can you prepare the breakfast now? I finish in 10 more minutes. Can you make strawberry smoothies by yourself while you are waiting for me? Yes, I can do that. I'll have Dad make it with me. Okay, darling. Daddy, I need your help now. Okay, my daughter. What can I help you with? I'm making strawberry smoothies, and I need to put all the ingredients in the blender, but... But what, Linda? It seems to break down. I've been trying to fix it, but no result. Can you help me, Dad? Absolutely. Just wait for me a second. What's the problem with the blender, daughter? I don't know. I may find the problem here. The ice is too big for it to blend, Linda. You have to use ground ice. Oh, I didn't know that. Let me bring it to you. Thank you so much, Dad. How far along are you two in making smoothies? Almost done, Mom. Honey, what are you going to prepare for breakfast? I haven't thought of it yet. Do you have any recommendations for today's breakfast? I'll ask Linda. Linda, what would you like to eat for breakfast? What about oatmeal with toast, Mom and Dad? Oh my god, Linda, we eat that every day of the week. I'm just kidding. Would you like something special? That's great. What is it? Instead of fried eggs as usual, why don't we try something other than eggs? How about pancakes? You know a long time since you made pancakes. Your dad just had a bright idea for today's breakfast, Linda. Yes, Mom. So let me make pancakes together. But now I'm extremely hungry, parents. Drink smoothies first, darling. Okay, let's prepare the most important meal of the day together. Oh, Daddy. You can just say breakfast instead of the long word like that. But I like it. Come on. Don't both of you want to have breakfast, right? Surely yes, baby. Linda, come here and make pancakes with us. I'm coming. Mom, is bacon left over? Yes, I put it in the fridge. What will you do with bacon? Hmm. Maybe bacon salad. Is that right, my little daughter? Oh my gosh, you know what I'm going to say. How telepathic. Mom, I'll make bacon salad eating with pancakes. That's fine. Do anything you want. 30 minutes later. Smith, call Linda to the table. Linda, what are you doing? It's time to tuck in. Coming down, Mom and Dad. Ooh, it looks so delicious. It's been a long time since I started losing weight. I did oatmeal for breakfast, chicken breast for lunch, and chicken salad for dinner. 
I'm fed up with all menus for going on a diet. You're so strict with yourself and losing weight. You can eat freely in the morning. Your mom is right, Linda. Today is my cheat day in losing weight process, so I can eat almost anything I like. <laughs> How splendid these pancakes are. Mom, you are an awesome cook. <laughs> I know it. <laughs> Linda, do you want to watch some morning news programs with me? Have you turned on the television? No. What, honey? You say no? Why are we not allowed to watch TV? TV makes your digestive system distracted, so no TV during eating. Only 30 minutes for a news program. Is that fine, Mom? I say no. Did you remember that you and I have the regular checkups last week and what the doctor said? I remember. So don't watch TV. It is a good habit we should get into, daughter. Smith, did you say you had to go to the office, correct? On the weekend? Well, I forgot to give some documents to the accountant department, so I have to go to the office. Just an hour and a half. What do you need my help with? Oh, no, I'm just asking. Mom, Dad, I suddenly remembered the dream I had last night. Let me talk to you. It is a little bit creepy. Linda, how many times do I have to remind you? About what, Mom? You shouldn't talk with your mouth full. Finish chewing, then you can talk. Oh, sorry, Mom, I forgot. I dreamt about a dangerous adventure. I was walking in the woods when suddenly some snakes came from somewhere and chased me. They're so fast. What a scary dream. I was both running and shouting, Dad, Mom, help me, loudly. And we appeared to help you in your dream? Luckily, the alarm went off at exactly the right time, so my parents didn't appear in my dream, and I was not eaten by the snakes. How lucky. You must have been scared, my little daughter. Let's drink some smoothies. Thank you, Dad. Mom, what date is it today? It's the 14th. What's wrong? The 14th? Mom, are you sure? Absolutely. I'm dead meat. Today is the corporate finance project due. I haven't finished yet. I still have one more part. Take it easy, daughter. You have all day to complete the part. You can do it. Thanks a lot, Mom. Mom is correct. You have a lot of time to do it. Don't worry too much. Let's keep on enjoying the meal. The pancakes are a little cold. Pancakes are so good, I can't help it. Mom, next time can you make it for me? Mother cooks the most delicious meals. Ugh, it must be sweet talk. No, I say the truth. Do you think so, Dad? That's true. You are the best cook in the world. Ugh, all right. I'll make strawberry smoothies and pancakes for both of you next time. <laughs> That's great, Mom. Delicious salad, Linda. You can follow in your mother's footsteps in cooking. <laughs> I'll try my best. <laughs> I feel stuffed. Can I leave first to do my assignment? Of course. We're done. I also feel full. So do I. Oh, it's 8 a.m. I have to go now. Bye, honey. Bye, Linda. See you soon. Goodbye, Daddy. Bye. Drive carefully, baby. I remember. See you. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, comment on my video. Please, subscribe to Learn English with Jessica channel to watch more helpful videos. Goodbye.